Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to my channel. I have iPhone 6s running on iOS 10.3.1 right here and I'm gonna be jailbreaking this phone. I am so lucky that I haven't updated my phone to the latest iOS version and I can still enjoy the perks of jailbreak. I'm gonna be using the H3 Lix or you can say a Helix jailbreak tool on this device to jailbreak it and let us see that in the settings general and about you can see here that the version is iOS 10.3.1 and the semi untethered and stable jailbreak is still out for this device there are a couple of other jailbreak tools which you can use but I'm gonna be using Helix jailbreak now this jailbreak method only works with the 64-bit iOS devices which have the iOS version 10.0 up to the 10.3.3 which includes the iPhone 5s iPhone 6 6s and iPhone 6s plus iPhone SE and iPhone 6 plus and if you have any of these devices that I have mentioned before then you can apply this process to jailbreak your phone so let us start so guys starting off what we need to do is first download the double helix jailbreak IPA file from this website using this button and then the latest version of CD impact on your PC or laptop and you're gonna need a laptop or PC for this because this method requires CD impactor and IPA file installation I already have downloaded both of the files which is the CD impactor and the double helix the links are in the description below for both of these files so starting the process I have here all the files ready here is the helix jailbreak file IPA and here is the CD impactor so what we need to do is connect the device to the PC so the device is connected properly I'm gonna put this device here and now I'm gonna launch the CD impactor so CD impactor is launched now I'm gonna drag the helix chair we have onto the CD impactor and it will ask for Apple ID this will be same you are using for your iTunes and your App Store so I'm gonna log in with my Apple ID So my Apple ID is successful and the Helix jailbreak IPA file is now installing and I'm going to wait for a few moments until it installs completely and then I'm going to get back to you guys. So CD impact is not going ahead from this point but the application has already been installed. You can see here and I think it's okay from this point if I just exit this and disconnect my phone the jailbreak tool app is now successfully installed on my phone and now i can proceed further and by tapping on it it says the untrusted developer and from this point i need to go to the settings general in profile and device management to trust the developer of this app here in device management this is the profile and i need to trust the profile here and it's trusted now so let's see what happens now this is the jailbreak app and this there I have the option to jailbreak my phone I'm gonna tap on this option and it is doing its processes and exploits and it will be jailbroken within a few moments and as you can see here the device is now respringing it means that the jailbreak is achieved so yeah guys I'm successful you can see here the CD is installed on my phone and I have successfully jailbroken my device here let us launch CD here so here it is guys this is CD let us go to the about studio so this is it guys i hope you like this tutorial and another thing i want to mention that this is the double helix app which is meant for 64-bit devices only but there is another version of this same app which is only known as helix jailbreak and that app can be used for 32-bit devices for ios 10.0 up to the ios 10.3.3 but this double helix jailbreak tool is only compatible with 
64 bit devices i have put the links in the description below of both the 32 bit helix jailbreak and 64 bit double helix jailbreak and the rest of the process is same for both 32 bit devices and 64 bit devices so i hope you like this video if you do then give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel till then have a nice day